This is Intro, and today I'm going to show you how to create a bootable device um, to boot your operating system on a USB. And this will be through the command prompt way. I actually have another way using the Windows 7 USB download or USB DVD download tool. And I have another video on that if you want to use that tool to um, do it instead of the, I guess, longer way, which is this way, um, or the more technical way. You're going to want to insert your USB that you're going to download the ISO on, the ISO, and click on command prompt. And you're going to want to type in disk part. Now this will pop up with the, um, it needs the allowance, so you're going to have to be on an administrator account for this to work. And you're going to want to, you can close the first window. A second command prompt should open, should open and it should say disk part right here. What you're going to want to type in is list disk, two separate words, and then select disk one because I am using the uh, USB, which is the 8 gigabyte device, and that's the second device right here because I know the, the bigger device is my hard drive. So you're going to select disk one and then click enter, and it says disk one is now select the selected disk. You're going to want to clean it. Even if you formatted it before, you're going to want to clean it again. And that should take a second to go through. And once it's done, you're going to want to create the partition primary. And it should say that it succeeded in creating that partition. And once that's done, you're going to want to click active and then once you, it says that your current partition is active you're going to want to format it or format FS FAT32 which is just the type um, of formatting um, technique that the PC will use when formatting it and then quick and this should say 0% complete and that should also take a second and once that's done, all you have to do is click or type in assign, and that will assign the partition to the drive. And then once that's done, you, once you type in assign, it, your drive should pop up in the Windows Explorer. And then all you're going to want to do is get your Windows image, mine right here. This is a Windows 8.1 image, and then you're just going to want to throw it onto the device. And this will take the obvious time because it's three point three and a half gigabytes of uh, memory to go onto the device but once it's on there you just wanna turn off your computer um, get into the BIOS um, change your boot order to USB first and um, click save it'll restart your PC and it'll boot on the USB and then just go through the setup um, for the operating system so thank you for watching and have a good day